Good afternoon. Or should I say good? Well, it is afternoon. Um, I'm on my lunch break. And I will do a quick YouTube video because I promised you two or three a week and I'm not supplying because my son is honorary <laughs> and I've been at work. This is my shirt. It says youth land. So I'm there from nine to six usually and I get an hour break. So I'm on my hour break and it's almost over. Um, so I thought I'd share with you really quick a short haul that I got. I might have already shared one of these, but I don't I can't remember. Um, and it is this paper right here. Look at this. Check this out. Beach paper. Remember how I told you I'm doing my bathroom in beach? I got this at... I don't remember where I got that. I want to say Joanne's. They had a... I either got it at Joanne's or Michael's. I went to both um, last weekend. And um, anyway, it's I've never seen paper like this before. It's got sliced paper in it. So when I do a mini album, I'm going to do a mini album for myself, which I've never done before. But I'm going to do a beach one. And it's just, I mean, the images are awesome in this. Um, they're phenomenal. So I got this. And I, I wrote down her name, and, and now I can't find the paper. So this is what I was talking about, messy woman. Look at this. Let's see if you can see it. So this is our kitchen table, and my husband allows this. My husband allows this. Let's me be messy like this. Like, that's a mess. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. And then the mess behind me. I'm just a messy, messy person. And I clean it up. And then guess what? We're looking for something. We gotta we gotta find it, right? Does anybody else do that? Like, oh so this week has been sorry, I dropped some stuff. Um, this week has been pretty great for me as far as blessings. Um I forgot her name, so when you see this on Facebook, write your name in here. Um she got me this blessing book. It's on um a group and this is the hundred the 100 Days of Bible Promises. I got this last weekend. I think it was last weekend. Last Thursday or something. And uh, I've been wanting this book. I posted that I wanted it and sent it. And I that she sent it to me. And this weekend I did do two quick. Um, this is his grace. His grace. Can you talk? It's sufficient. And this is where we do a die cut swap with Robin Scrapness. And I love this. I wanted to, but I was like, you know what? It's perfect in this book. So I used, uh, I made out of little pieces of sandpaper, but it's hard to use what I have um, so that I use up my stuff. And I'm not doing that. I'm going out and buying new stuff. But this weekend, I didn't go buy anything except for that notebook that I bought. Um, but I have sandpaper to make the clouds, and this is the first page. And what it is is you read it, and then you kind of read scripture about when you do it. This one's about don't be there's actually two of these that are don't be afraid. And I put these tabs in here side so that I could do like um like kind of like uh like go back and look at the index not today. Um and it to a couple of the couple of the pages are about like don't be afraid. And I didn't really know how to do that, but this is the page. And this is using the bottle stamp set for a swap and I ended up not using it, but it had a trading card in it and I was like, well what am I gonna do with that? I kept it. And I put it in here. Um, you know, I just have been struggling with, I have depression. And I have a wonderful son. I have a wonderful husband. It's nothing like that. It's just, um, like, what makes me happy? What What do I want? And that's a big thing for me because it's like, what do I want? This is me. What doesn't relax me? Um, how can I change my mind like if I'm upset about something how do I change my mind to be happy about it and focused on it so um for me the beach does it 
Um, you know, you see the pictures online, instant relaxation. And that's because I lived in a small town called Alaska. We used to go to the beach to relax. So, um, you know, it's just we got to train our mind to relax. And we have to think of something that relaxes us and get our mind up. Okay, it's okay. You're going to make it through another day. You know, it's like I didn't know that I would have any gifts for my son for his birthday. I can afford his birthday party. He's getting the and tees. He's only three, but guys, we only live once. You know, I want my son to look back and remember the things that his mom did with him or did for him. And yeah, he might not remember this one, but I'll, you know, it's something that makes me happy is to throw my son a birthday party. I'd rather buy, a, you know, my son a million things. For, and that's just the way I am. I spent my last dollar on my son. Uh, but my, you know, what relaxes me, you know, what doesn't take a million of my time? Just I'm gonna show you this. This here was a box that we bought at a yard sale. It was like 25 cents. And um, first thing that comes to my mind is a shadow box for my bathroom. So I made this. Yeah, it's not the best. It needs a lot of work. It needs guys to tell me what I can do to finish this up. Like this bottom is actually sand. I put sand in there and glued it in and used this awesome glue that I love here. It's called, I wanted it to E6000, but I think it's E3000. 6000. It is 6000. It's a game of picking that up. But it's, um, Allure Gorilla, and they had it at Hobby Lobby. I bought this a long time ago. I actually bought it for this. I finally finished. I joined a mixed media group, and we had to do mixed media. I've never mixed media before. So I started with sandpaper, <laughs> and it didn't stick. Look, E6000, it works. This guy. And he looks better in person. It looks really bad in the camera. But this is actually a blue, like, the blue curtain. These are glittery. This nose is glittery. This is, a, like, looks like waves, and it actually has a texture to it. It's that glue. And then I glued the seashells on. So, how cool is that? But we had to make uh, 35 at the start. Then it was 26. So... I ended up finally finishing these this morning before I left for work. Trevor gave me a few minutes to focus on what I had to do. But I was like, well, I have all this leftover sand. I have seashells. What can I do? So my friend gave me, well, actually, I bought, it's right here, actually. I bought a couple rolls of this a long time ago because I wanted to do cricket vinyl and stuff. But I'm so scared to do it. Does anybody else like that? Scared to just... Do something. Bible journal. Anything. We just need to embrace it. And so I just took this blue vinyl that I had and put it in here on the bottom of the box. And I know it's missing spots here, but I was thinking about getting, like, Jolie's Mix the Birds, the uh, um, Seagulls stickers, getting something like that. Or, um, I don't know. I just don't know what to finish, how to finish this. So, any ideas? Toss them out there. Let me know what you like. I think it looks bad. <laughs> I am uh, okay with constructive criticism. I take it very well. Um, also, I'm one of those where, like, I'm not going to join any more swaps the rest of the month. And then I'm like, this one sounds cool. I'm going to do this one. And then I kind of like overdo it. And then I'm like, uh oh. But I have nailed out almost all of my swaps. I have one for Robins that's got to go out probably tomorrow. Because I get paid tomorrow. And I have one for Mandy's Place that has to go out. And then I joined one on Mandy's Place that's a dollar store swap. Because I'm addicted to the dollar store. And it doesn't sound like it's going to be too bad. Even though I made never made some of the stuff. Um, but it's one of them's tassels. And I looked at the video. And it's not that hard. So that's cool. Um, but anyway, the other reason I came on here is because. Let's see if we can get that on there. It's not going to come in. But Judith Franklin. Uh, we do a swap online. It's called Loves to Scrap. I want to say Loves the Bible Journal. It's probably something else. 
um, sent me a book, and she said that it wasn't very good. But let me show you really fast because then I had to go back to work. This jump drum. So this is it. She had it tied up with burlap. And you open it up, and the pages are beautiful. She did a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful job. And this is an envelope. And then there's this, and this opens up here. I never thought to do this. I do mini albums all the time. Why didn't I think of this? Like, you know what you could do, too? You could put another card on top and just make, like, a fold out. How cool would that be? So, I'm just going to do a quick flip through. But if you want to see more, please like this video. Please like me. Send me some su subscribers. I'm new. I mean, I've been scrapbooking for a long time. Mini albuming, card making, all that stuff. And um, I just, everybody's like, why don't you do YouTube? Because I can't. Yeah, you can. You got a laptop, right? Yeah. Does it got a webcam? No. Yes, it does. This is what I'm videoing for him. It's a um, Acer or Len L E N O V O computer idea pad. It's pretty cool. I think I got it just for cricketing. But uh, this lady, this her work is phenomenal, and she thinks she didn't do very good. And I think this is really amazing. This is an envelope. There's a lot of envelopes. This one got ripped somehow. The package was messed up, but I can fix that. I love these mason jars. These are beautiful. And we talked about becoming pimps of these. Um, it made her cry, and I felt bad, but she said, And I showed you my book. This is my favorite here. Because I just did. Um, like a, I don't know, like a notes, like notes. And one of the pages that I drew in there was some prayer requests that I had. And then I wrote on um, the papers. And guess what? He went out in my prayer this year. My prayer this year. My prayer this month because he got me this stuff about you then. Um, he's off St. And Trevor's getting a lot of and turning wanted to do but I felt like I was there. Like he needs a stimulation, he needs to play. So anyway, I could just good. That's why I don't do YouTube videos. Distracted. Focus Jeff. So I mean she did a beautiful washi tape and the pages for some reason are super thick. It's a dollar store journal because I thought that that's what we were supposed to use a dollar store. But I'm because this has a lot of pages. Same thing that mine did. This back, I'll show you. But I mean, that just shows her and character into this book. I mean, this book is phenomenal that she did to get too close. So, I mean, she just did every page. Is, those two pages are like. But that's cool. I'd like to know, too, what kind of glue she used because they make the page thicker. Envelopes. She must have a printer, too, because a lot of the pages you can tell. Like, they will see her. So, but I want to know what book she binded it, how she binded it together. If she bought a dollar store journal, because on the back, there's like this texture. You can't even see on here. You can see a little bit. This texture is amazing on here. I wonder how she did this. Because I'm always techniques, not like I need to buy any more stuff, right? Especially with the husbands. Husbands. Husby. It's a new one. Um, the texture is amazing, beautiful, like, rose, it's just amazing, amazing, I love it, I don't know how she did it, it's like, I wonder if it's Tim, Tim Holtz, that stuff, like that, I don't buy Tim Holtz, I can't afford him, he's not my price range, I'm a dollar store, Hobby Lobby, Clarence Rag, it's me, 
you for watching me and I just want to say I'm a messy girl. I'm organized. I'm a scatterbrain. Um, I know that no matter what, and you already know tomorrow's going to be a lot of it. All right. Here comes the 16-minute video.